and so hi, this is Nick, talking to you and spending time with you now in this guided meditation and sleep hypnosis experience that I have written to help you set aside over the coming while we spend together any feelings of anxiety or any troubling unease before bedtime so that you can fully wind down at the end of the day releasing all reflections all daytime distractions and all perceived burdens and expectations and in this session I'm going to help you move away from any unsettling emotions associated with the past as well as from any anxieties about the future and bring you back to the simple purity of the present because it really is in the timeless moment of the here and now when you're no longer looking backwards and no longer looking forwards that your mind can settle calm quieten and by looking inwards rather than outwards usher you away to your deepest levels of relaxation they're on towards a night of your most restorative and revitalizing sleep. And if you are familiar with my hypnosis and guided meditations, as always, you will know it is important to me that I have written and composed this self-hypnosis experience in the spirit and with the intention, expectation and belief that wherever you are in the world, whatever you are facing and wherever you are going, tomorrow will be a better day than today. And in the spirit of empathy and understanding, I sincerely do hope that in the coming days, the coming weeks, and the coming months, when you find yourself relaxing more easily, sleeping more deeply, and living life more fully, you will consider supporting this community by subscribing, by sharing this video with somebody whom you feel may benefit, or simply by leaving an encouraging comment. And while it really does take only a few moments of your time to give your support, your encouraging words may help a fellow listener who may be struggling with adversity or facing other life challenges right now. So I thank you in advance for your humanity and your compassion, as well as for choosing my words for your bedtime journey. And so as you listen along now, as you familiarize yourself with the tones and rhythms of my voice, and as you find yourself beginning to relax, you should know that even though you will soon be resting deeply and going on to sleep so soundly, should something unexpectedly arise during this trance that requires your full attention, then rest assured you will always be able to open your eyes and instantly return to your alert awake state where you will be fully capable of applying your attention to whatever is needed. And so with that in mind, whenever you are ready, why don't you settle back somewhere comfortable? 
ease into the resting position of your choice and begin to draw all observational energies away from the outside world away from all daytime distractions and bring them closer towards you so that your full focus and attention reside with you here and only here right here in this room right here in the protective nurturing spaces of your own subconscious mind and immersing yourself into this state of intense relaxation really can be as easy for you now as just letting go of that short range focus allowing your gaze to drift away into the distance just somewhere over there and allowing your eyelids to slowly draw together so they come to rest in that dreamy half open half closed state where your tired muscles in and around your eyes can begin to loosen to soften and to release in turn a wave of relaxation that spreads to your jaw across to your temples and to all of the muscles and fibres in your neck and shoulders and beyond and it's in these dreamier and more peaceful moments that you perhaps find yourself noticing that there's a subtle shift in your perception an emerging change to the kind of expanding awareness that comes with the feeling that those tired and heavy eyes so desperately want to close so why don't you do just that let those blinking eyes come together now and set in motion all of those beautiful inner processes that can so skillfully and so artfully guide you all the way down to sleep now and with your eyes gently closed like this you can allow your other senses to instinctively respond by elevating their sensitivity to the ambience of the room around you as you perhaps feel your tired body blending into the surface below you the sensation of your head and your hair resting lightly on that cushion or pillow or the soft touch of the bed sheets on your resting arms and legs as you bring into this inner experience also any subtle aromas or any nearby or distant sounds and any imagined visualization of the colors the tones and the textures around you in this place you know so well that's right just noticing and picturing in your mind the presence of everything around you as you continue to draw your awareness closer and closer without any inner criticism analysis or judgment or any kind of emotional reaction other than the simple acknowledgement that as you feel yourself letting go you are right here and right now 
so very present in this safe and comfortable moment where you have the freedom and all permissions to shape this hypnosis into whatever you want it to be. Because although you are listening to my voice here, this at all times remains your personal journey of discovery. My words, they're just a helpful guide to set you on your way. A friendly nudge in the right direction, if you like. Because we all need a little help relaxing from time to time, don't we? And you really can choose to experience this calming hypnosis in so many pleasingly different ways. For you can enjoy this trance simply by allowing your mind to wander, knowing that you don't have to consciously follow along. You can just let it all wash over you in the same way as you simply absorb other familiar background sounds. Like the light buzz of distant traffic, or the soft hum of a nearby conversation. Remembering, of course, that as you drift in and drift out, your unconscious mind will always be listening paying attention, recording and using any positive suggestions, any positive ideas and thoughts, and keeping you engaged at just the right level of trance that is most appropriate for your learning, your healing, and your most relaxing benefit. Or of course, you can choose to enjoy an extended journey into your deepest sense of calm. Winding down at a slower pace, lingering consciously for just a little longer with my soothing voice. Perhaps listening a little more attentively and a little more actively maybe even wondering just what it is about the patterns of my words that makes you feel so sleepy. Because after all, your relaxation is too important and too valuable to rush. And it's so pleasurable, is it not? to just take your time and enjoy the feeling of your mind slowing down. Noticing all the subtle changes that come when your conscious awareness begins to drift away. Your body feeling a little lighter your heartbeat becoming a little slower, your breathing becoming a little longer. And it is always interesting to notice that when you begin to pay attention to your breathing, it all begins to slow down Those inhalations, those exhalations, instinctively becoming a little longer and a little lighter. And you might notice yourself noticing now also 
how those pauses between each breath in and each breath out and between each breath out and each breath in they naturally expand in line with these calming rhythms and of course it's so nice to luxuriate in those growing pauses And I wonder if you have ever noticed that the longer you comfortably reside in those spaces between breaths, when you just allow the cadence of those inhalations and exhalations to instinctively slow down, the more relaxed you become. So go ahead and take a few moments to notice the soothing changes that arise when your mind becomes so settled, so quiet and so clear. There really is nothing else to think about other than allowing each cycle of breath to become just a little bit longer a little bit lighter and a little bit softer than the last. And you can take yourself down to even deeper levels of relaxing serenity simply by following my lead here. As I count you through your next few cycles of breathing. Inhaling for a count of four, three, two, one. Holding your breath, four, three, two, one. And breathing out, four, three, two, one. Holding. Four, three, two, one. And once again now, breathing in. Four, three, two, one. Holding. Four, three, two, one. Breathing out. Four, three, two, one. Holding. Four, three, two, one. And one more time, breathing in. Four, three, two, one. Holding. Four, three, two, one. And now breathing out. Four, three, two, one. And there's just something reassuringly soothing about counting downwards. Something intangible that you can't quite put your finger on. But nevertheless makes you feel so tired and so drowsy. Perhaps it's because of how you were set down to sleep at night as a baby. Or maybe how when the sun goes down, it signifies the end of the day. Or maybe because it feels like you're traveling on a giant downward escalator, descending in a slow moving elevator, or floating downstream on a warm summer's day. And I wonder if you can imagine or picture yourself in your mind's eye now 
in the relaxing scene of laying back on a large sailboat, enjoying the soft glow of a setting summer sun, the hint of a breeze in the air, as you feel the easy rhythms of a gentle current rocking you this way and that way. And this truly is one of those rare, carefree times in your life when you're completely at ease and at peace. A time when you really do have nowhere else to be, nowhere else to go, and nothing else to do other than to rest back Enjoy this summer evening and watch the world go by. And as you just continue to relax and feel the residues of the past day beginning to ease away, you might find yourself considering what an interesting sensation it is to feel yourself resting back here on your bed or on your couch while at the same time imagining yourself drifting lazily downstream in this beautiful countryside where you're enjoying the soothing solitude and the meandering motion of this gently twisting and turning river that's passing through scenery so vibrant and so colourful it can only have come from your own imagination. A very special place in the deep recesses of your mind that can instantly conjure up for your pleasing relaxation gorgeous mountain valleys, lush green meadows, and picturesque vistas of white snow-capped peaks reaching high into deep blue skies, and of towering pine trees swaying sedately from side to side, as though moving in time to the slow beat of a relaxing lullaby. And in the distance, just somewhere down there, you can see the ultimate destination of this twisting and turning river. A large, beautiful crystal lagoon, where the water is so pure, so inviting, and so still. And you instinctively know all you need to do to reach that entrancing and peaceful lagoon is to just settle back. Allow yourself to float freely and trust in the gentle current and the soft guiding hands of your own relaxing mind to take you where you need to go. And as you become increasingly absorbed in the delightful inner sensations, feelings, and energies of your own mind, the closer you drift towards that crystal oasis, the slower it all becomes. because you're floating so peacefully and so easily through the loving, welcoming,
truly imaginative channels of your subconscious now. Beneath an overhead sky of a most vividly glorious sunset, reflecting and shimmering on the soft, rippled surface of that beautiful blue water. And as you rest back and observe your own thoughts and sensations, you're floating now through an archway of beautiful old oak trees. Late afternoon sunshine streaming through the network of tangled limbs that stretch out deep and high, casting mottled patterns and shadows that dance and come alive on the gently flowing water. And as you drift so serenely through this beautiful shaded archway, it comes to mind that the true strength of these powerful oak trees lies not in what you see above the ground, but in what lies beneath the surface. The hidden roots that spread far and wide to underpin the growth of these majestic trees. Because without these solid foundations, there is no growth. There is no beauty. And there is no strength. And you might find also, as you gaze upwards into the branches of these overhanging trees, when you look just a little more closely, you notice that these beautiful trees are not as pristine as you first imagined. That there are, in fact, among the strong, robust branches, many skewed and distorted limbs, and that there are also many battle scars among the bark on those sturdy trunks. And you begin to understand now that growth is not always easy or painless. And that, in fact, these trees are constantly healing, constantly regenerating, and constantly regrowing. As they patiently wait for days like this, when the sun shines, when the birds sing, when the flowers bloom, and when life, in all of its wonderful variety, flourishes. Because these wise old oaks know that the seasons are temporary. And that when storms, and the winds, and the cold, and the rain arrive, so they will at some point in the future move on, leaving behind warmer, sunnier and brighter days. And that is an inspiring thought to hold on to, as you find yourself floating now into the vast expanses of that beautiful lagoon. Where you're free now to just drift so easily. And to just go with the flow of wherever your subconscious mind wishes to take you. Because you're here now 
in this beautiful self-hypnosis of your very own creation. Here in the deepest, most protectively peaceful folds of your inner self. A world that holds all kinds of wisdom and wonders, just waiting to be discovered, or even rediscovered. And I wonder what you would find here if you chose to look around. What answers would you find if you asked the right questions? What ideas and ambitions lie dormant among the depths of these still waters? past goals that have perhaps been forgotten or even discarded due to falsehoods or limiting beliefs. And maybe all that's needed to restore these dreams is simply a fresh moment of inspiration, a few kind and compassionate inner words or perhaps, quite simply, a personal commitment from this point on to be true to yourself and to your dreams and aspirations, to look forward only with positive energy, to unshackle yourself from the past and the future and to live only in the present, free from all negative emotions. And as you find yourself gazing upwards once more, you're noticing that the late afternoon has transitioned into evening. that rich blue sky is now a solid black tapestry. And you're bathing in the glow of soft moonlight under the watchful eye of the universe and its ancient stars. And it's all so relaxed and so serene to just rest here within your own calm and quiet mind. As you look upwards with such awe and such wonderment, not just into the night sky but into the expansive realms of your own imagination. And I wonder if you can imagine now how it would feel to be able to float out there among those vast expanses. To become one with the universe's creative and healing energies. To become the moon, to become the sun, to become the stars, to ride with the light across colourful distant galaxies, to navigate the past, the present and the future. And what will you learn about yourself out here? In these outer and inner spaces where there are no boundaries to where your mind can travel. 
when you can reconnect with all distant past memories and discover all future moments. What comes to you in these timeless, weightless moments of pure freedom? What learnings and what inspirations will you find here? Because there is no better time than now, when you are truly present and truly aligned with all of your inner wisdoms, to give yourself the gift of a question, a dream, or a vision, to plant the seeds for your rich and glorious life, right here in the fertile soil of your all-knowing, all-understanding subconscious. So why don't you go ahead and allow your mind to become one with the universe's limitless healing and rejuvenating energies. As with each longer, lighter, deeper breath, you float away high into the cosmos and descend down into yourself. Breathing in hope and positivity. Breathing out doubt and negativity. Breathing in love and understanding. Breathing out hate and disdain. Breathing in compassion and care. Breathing out jealousy and envy. As you find yourself once more gazing upwards into the vast infinity of the universe and at all of those distant stars that now seem to shine with a little more luminosity because they now represent all of your better tomorrows, all of the sparkling moments of joy in your life that are yet to come, all of your hopes, all of your opportunities, and all of your success. And there is nothing more for you to do now than simply rest back and succumb to sleep's irresistible call. To flow so pleasingly into your personal haven of healing, where overnight you can cleanse, recharge and refresh, and absorb all intuitive inner wisdom. As you let all lingering conscious thoughts just drift away. And as you float into the purest, deepest sleep, your internal rhythms carrying you so soundly and so gently. As all of the beautiful sounds and vistas of the universe settle around and within you, soothing and guiding you to complete rest.
as you just go deeper and deeper and deeper. Good night, sleep well, and until the next time, with my deepest and my very best regards, Nick.